What is up guys, Zach Scott here playing Pokemon Scarlet and last time you checked in, well I was checking out the school here, I uh, I fought against Cassiopeia, I won, I disbanded uh, the this, this Starfall thing or whatever, <laughs> so we're going to move on and uh, I apologize for not having any videos for a while in terms of Pokemon, hold on, someone's calling me, hold on, someone's calling me, Z-Dog, yes Penny, what's up, Cassiopeia, Penny, whoever, no, not anymore, there's something I want to talk to you about. Could you come meet me in front of the school stairs? You know where we first met. I'll be waiting. Okay, I did not. I should have done this at the end of last episode, but I didn't because I didn't know. But that's okay. Uh, let's let's get over there really quick. And uh, you know, I, I do apologize for not having videos lately. I had COVID, but I'm okay now. I better uh, prepare for a blitz of videos. So let's go talk to Cassiopeia. I can I can run right. I can. Here, let me just get on this. This will be faster. Big jump. What's up? Mesa Goza, what's up? Here I am. Penny, tell me what you must. Number one Eevee fan here. All right. Asa la V-Star. <laughs> the six of us thought up that catchphrase back when we created the team. It's so cringy, it's perfect, you know? I liked it. Anyway, about the LP thing, I thought I was going down big time for hacking the league point system, but they're letting me off easy. That's great. The Pokemon League said they'll waive my debt if I do some volunteer engineering for them. They even asked me to come work for them after I graduate, if you can believe that. Director Clavel and, and that Gita lady kept complimenting me like a weird amount. Apparently, I have outstanding talent or something. Sorry for calling you out here to meet like this. I'm still not so great with people face to face. I never seem to find the right words, but um, thank you so much. You saved Team Star and my friends along with it. I know words will never be enough to properly thank you for all you've done, so here. <laughs> Alright, Draco Meteor. That's pretty cool. What is that? Comets are summoned down from the sky onto the target and lowers the user's... Uh, oh, wait. The, the recoil from this move harshly lowers the user's... So why would I want to do that? I don't know. I'm sure you'll put this to good use. And one more thing. I want to repay the debt I owe you. If you ever think of a way I can do that, just let me know. I'm great with machines and hacking and stuff. So next time, I'll be the one helping you, Z-Dog. All right, great. Be seeing you then, Asla V-Star. All right, that was a cool little touch. Good to hear from her again. Starfall Street is now complete. I thought I completed it last episode, but now it's complete officially. We're going to take on, like, the, what is it, Victory Road, Rainbow Four? Vict <laughs> what's, what's it called? <laughs> I'm just making up words now. The Elite Four, right? Maybe. That's what we're going to do. Uh, so to do that, let me look at the map. And I hit the wrong button. This is the map right there. And uh, where to? Where is it? There we go. Can I just travel there? Oh, man. Okay. Well, we're just going to set the destination there. Uh, let's go this way, I think. We'll get over there. We'll have some fun. But yeah, COVID was no fun. Uh, at all and I was kind of out like for a while there like I just had to rest a lot Like I didn't have the energy to record videos. It was it. What the heck is happening? What the heck is happening? What is this? There's no way. Okay, maybe I shouldn't have gone up here. Honestly Okay, I guess we're fine. I don't know what the heck just happened, but hey, I'll I'll take you. Yeah, you're good. You're good. Give me ghoul. Let's go. Oh, come on. I did not run into that. It ran into me. Run. Is A-Dog in the lead right now? Hold on. Let me look at my my Pokemon. Yeah, A-Dog. Did I switch him? I thought... Anyway. I thought uh, right she was. Whatever. There's someone here. Uh, should I face off against a trainer? The Pokemon League building looks so cool. Let's see what you have to offer. Maybe you can level me up a little bit. I'm making my way to the Pokemon League. Let's battle to mark the occasion. All right. Sure enough, we will. Jackson, the student. I don't remember what Meowth is. Uh, I do have my Pokemon type chart up, though, so that's good. And I just don't want to waste a ton of time. But Meowth is uh, f normal, right? So he's weak to fighting. Do I have any fighting on me right now? I don't think I do. But it's like level 14, so let's not even worry about it. <laughs> I don't know why there's someone so weak here. 
What a waste of time. All right. Gotcha. All right, all right. I'm out. Well, losing one, losing's one way to mark an occasion. Sure is. We could have just said a friendly hello. You could have got my autograph or something. I'm not going to fight another person here. Come on, dude. Like, level 14. No. No. Destination is here. And uh, sure enough, let's meet over here. And let's do what we got to do because we got to do something big. We got to recruit Nimona, right? And this is the start of this. Hello, Z Dog, says Gita. So, this is it. You decided to face the Pokemon League. The final test you must pass to become a champion. Great. Is held here in this building. <laughs> I wish you the best of luck from the bottom of my heart, Z Dog. I look forward to meeting you again soon. Great. Nothing is bad. This is all good. Why are you blocking the door, punk? Are you ready to face the Pokemon League's champion assessment? Yes. Let's see here. Z-Dog from Naran uh, Academy, is it? It appears you have a total of eight gym badges. Very well. You may now proceed to the interview room. All right. I just want to battle. I don't want to interview. I don't want to answer any questions. Let my fists do the talking. You know what I'm saying? All right. Great room. All right. Hello. Thank you for coming today. Please do have a seat. This is Rika. All right, I will sit. I, Rika, will be your interviewer. Is it Rika or Rika? I don't know. Let's get started with the first portion of the champion assessment. I would say it's Rika, right? We begin with the interview. First things first, let me see how many gym badges you have. Excellent, you have all eight. Next, I'd like to ask you a few questions if you don't mind, Z-Dog. Please think carefully as you may automatically fail to the interview depending on your answers. Let's begin. How did you get here today? I rode on my Pokemon. That's true, very good, very good. Please tell me the name of the school you are enrolled in. Naranha Academy. Ah, that's right. So what brings you to the Pokemon League today? I came to become a champion. Yes, indeed. Why else would you be here, I suppose? Now, what do you intend to do if and when you become a champion? I want to become even stronger. I see. Interesting. Tell me, which of the eight gyms gave you the most difficulty? Oh, my gosh. I don't remember. Uh, <laughs> I literally don't remember. I can't tell you the gyms just by the name. Let me look through my thumbnails really quick, because maybe that'll spark some memory if I pull up all my Pokemon videos. Uh, jeez. Let me just pull up Pokemon gym videos. Uh, I think the Glaciato was easy. I think they were all pretty... I think maybe uh, the Lavincia gym with gym leader Iono. I think I lost my first battle against her, maybe. If my memory serves me correctly. It's been a while. So let's just say the Lavincia gym... I see. And what was the name of the gym leader you faced there? Well, like I said, I had my uh, my my uh, thumbnails and my my videos open, so it was it was Iono. I'm glad you seem to remember. I did not remember. I had notes. <laughs> but do you remember which type of Pokemon Iono used? <laughs> oh, come on. Uh, I let me. I'm just gonna Google this. I don't want to open the video and have the sound play. Uh, gym leader Iono. Uh, electric. I might be wrong about her being the toughest, but I mean, like, I think I remember her being the toughest. Wonderful. Building the skills needed for the champion assessment is no small feat. You must have met a lot of Pokemon to get here, Z Dog. Yes, indeed. Oh my gosh, what was the category of the Pokemon you chose to be your first partner? The grass cat Pokemon, yes. What is with this quiz? <laughs> very good, very good. Now please forgive me, but I'm going to repeat a previous question. Remind me, what do you tend to do? Uh, I want to become even stronger. 
Is that a bad answer? I also want to face the Mona. Probably. Ah, yes, that's right. This reminds me of one time I, w I came out of surgery in a hospital and they were asking me the same questions they asked me when I checked in. I was so mad. I was like coming off anesthesia and my emotions were just raw. And I was so angry that they were asking me the same exact questions. I was like, I already answered this. It messed with me, man. Final question. Do you like Pokemon, Sea Dog? <laughs> yes. I'll be fighting now. <laughs> Pokemon are dumb. What you thinking about? Good job, kiddo. Great. That about wraps up the interview. Wonderful. And let me be the first to congratulate you, Z-Dog. You just passed the first part of the champion assessment. On your first try, too, no less. Don't think anyone's done that since Nimona. That's my girlfriend. But anyway, time to switch gears and get ready for the next segment. The second segment is what we call the Elite Test. And you'll be facing the Elite Four in Pokemon Battles. Yeah, the Elite Four. That's what I said. I guess that's pretty obvious from the name of the test, huh? Anyway, we're the best the league has the, to offer. You'll be facing us four in a row. No turning back. This won't be a cakewalk. I promise you that. Make sure you're all ready to go, then go into the room behind me. I think I'm ready. One thing I forgot, though. Do I have enough stuff in my bag to heal and revive? I have 17 revives. I have... I don't think I have enough potions, honestly. Maybe I should go get more. Um, can I do that? Can I just, like, back out for the second? There's no turning back now. Okay. Well, I'm ready then, I guess. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> I guess I just won't try to use that many. Gosh, man. All right. I'll just do good. Do my best. Uh, who's first? All right. Wait, is that... Wait. Is that the same person? It is. Not wearing glasses, though. Now then, let's get started, huh? Let's let o o Rika be the first of the Leap 4 to take you on. Or Rika, I'd say I go easy on you, but I'd be lying. Think fast. All right, here we go. All right, I'm ready. What are you sitting out? Oh, uh, Whiskash. That's a water type. It has to be, right? Uh, Whiskash Pokemon. It's, it is a. Oh, hold on. I finally got to battle you. I've been looking forward to it. Whatever. Uh. Hold on. Which wait? Which cash is a? It's a it's a water ground, right? So it's weak to grass. Is it really a ground? Don't worry. Swapping in this. Muddy water. Not very effective against me. My accuracy fell though. I just hit him with this flower trick. Never misses, right? Oh, it's only level 57. That's great news. Awesome. Got him. Critical hit too. All right. Uh, now what? Oh, great. A dog leveled up. Uh, armor cannon. Oh, A dog wants to learn armor cannon. Let's see what armor cannon even is. Uh, it's a nice move. One twenty one hundred. I guess I could forget lava plume. It's like the same thing as flamethrower, basically, right? Let's forget lava plume. I hope I did the right thing. All right. Sure. Uh, Camerupt. What the heck is Camerupt? It is a 
fire ground. It's weak to water. Do I have water? I don't have water. Wait, wait. Okay, is it is it really a fire ground? Hold on. I'm looking at a weird site. Camera up. I'm looking at the main site. <laughs> it's weak to ground and to water. I don't have water, do I? I do have a ground move uh, in the form of H Dog's dig. That's it, though, man. Okay, let's just do it. Swap in H Dog. We'll do what we got to do. This is my first time seeing Camera Up, I think. Super effective. Get me out of here. I, I'm glad that I out level these Pokemon right now. That, that'll help me out. I didn't know I was ready for this yet. Maybe I wasn't. Hit him. Oh, not quite dead, unfortunately. Yawn. Oh, no. Put me to sleep, my dude. All right. Let me just do a quick little uh, crunch. Hopefully that finishes him off. Yes. Now you can feel free to fall asleep, H Dog. I guess. How many Pokemon does she have, by the way? Is she is is he asleep? Yeah, H Dog fell asleep. Uh Doug Trio. That sounds Let me look it up. Doug Trio. Yeah, I thought so. I, I knew I knew what it was just by hearing about it. It's been around for a while, right? Doug Trio is a ground, weak to water, grass, ice. I do have some ice. But I have this amazing flower trick ability, so let's just bring this out. Uh, all right. Flower trick. This move is so good. Super effective. Critical hit. Goodbye, Doug, Doug Trio. Uh, Donfin. I, mean, I do not know my Pokemon. I, I don't recognize these just by like the name. Donfin is interesting in the fact that it's a, another ground type. So it's gonna be weak to the same stuff. So this, I guess Rika has a bunch of ground stuff. I guess. Now I bet, will the next one Terrasalize? That's what I wanna know. I bet it, oh, it's not dead. It didn't faint. It had Sturdy, oh no. Poison Jab, I don't like that. Oh God, super effective. Uh, let's just do a, another, let's just do a slash really quick. All right, I don't like that I'm poisoned. I really need to heal that and heal myself. Uh, Claude Sire, what the heck? And, and so I don't know if it, so I really don't know what's gonna happen here. Uh, Claude Sire, what is Claude Sire? Hold on. This, this I bet, I, I almost wonder if it'll terrestrialize into, uh, how do, what, am I, am I misreading this? Is it not Claude Sire? I'm Googling Claude Sire, I'm not seeing any, oh, there it is. All right, this is a poison ground. I bet it's terrestrialized to ground, I guess. I don't know. I'm so worried about it. Let's just keep the current Pokemon and I'll try to heal myself. I don't like the poison aspect though. You really are something else, kiddo. I'm a little worried. If, if it stays as a ground, that'll be great. I'm gonna just try to hit him with Flower Trick. Yeah, Terrasalize, let's finish this. Go on, Cloud, Cloud Sire, shake things up a bit. So I should have Terrasalized myself, honestly. I'm assuming she's Terrasalizing it to a ground. Yep. Well. This move will still be good. I just worry that it won't one-hit him. Oh, it did, though. Nice. I hope I can heal my Pokemon in between fighting her and fighting the next person. Claude Sire fainted.
Excellent. I defeated Rika of the Elite Four. She looks a little disappointed, but she's clapping. Not bad, kiddo. Great. I need to heal. If I can. Still clapping. Talk about unfair. No way I was ever going to win that one. Still, though, what a great battle. Felt good even to lose. Not a whole lot of trainers have the skill to make it past the elite test. But who knows? I'm beginning to think you might be one of the few that do, Z-Dog. Better stay on your toes, though. The second of the Elite Four is stronger than me. You're up next, Squirt. Come on out. Poppy. Cooming. All right. So... Oh, wow. Did you lose, Rika? Rika? Yeah, I did. He's no pushover, let me tell you. I'll be watching from the side. Avenge me if you can, huh? You bet I will. Great. I, can, can I heal? Oh, I can. Great. Perfect. Perfect. In my bag. H-Dog's asleep. Give him a wake-up medicine. Uh, which is... Awakening. Use that on you. I don't... Am I still poisoned? Hold on. Am I still... No. And then, uh, let's use... Since, since we're, you know, behind the scene, let's just use a bunch of potions. No. Let's, let's use a couple super potions instead. <laughs> that was not going well. Uh, here we go. Use that. All right, great. We're off to a great start. No idea what this little girl's going to send out, so let's just be cool about it. Are you ready to face Poppy of the Elite Four? I guess so. I don't know what she's going to send out. I hope to get a good read on her, though, to know what she's going to, uh, you know, send out. I don't know what type she has. It's so cool you made it this far, but this is where you say bye-bye, mister. All right. Uh, All my Pokemon are super tough. Your weak attacks won't work on them at all. They'll bounce right off you. You'll see. I can't wait for you to meet my friends, so here they come. All right, great. It's like a big metal key. You were challenged by Poppy of the Elite Four. Everybody wants to be Poppy, Poppy. Copper a job. That, that's a steel, right? It's a copper type. No, it's a steel type. That means it's weak to fire. So this could actually be really good for me. Uh, oh, I'm already the fire. Okay, great. Uh, Flamethrower. Yeah, that's super effective. Let's go. This is wonderful. All right, super, you're gone. Excellent. Maybe they'll all be steel type or whatever. Bronze on. That sounds like a steel. All right. This one might be easier than the previous one. Oh, dang. I hate that it doesn't finish him off. Oh, wait. Maybe the fire will finish him off. It's burned, but what does that mean? Earthquake. No. Oh, no. Oh, that's super effective, but it somehow didn't do much at all. Is it? It's on fire. There we go. Great. Awesome. Corviknight. Sounds like a steal. <laughs> Let's just keep the current Pokemon. Uh, is that a steal? I'm not face off again, so let me look it up really quick. All right, Corviknight's a flying steal. Okay. Flamethrower. <laughs> just... Yeah, ah, oh, man, but, man. All right. It's leaving him alive, though. Iron defense, what does that do? Defense rose sharply. I just had to get you one more time. Oh, that didn't wasn't enough to finish it, it off anyway. Uh, let's... Dang, dude. Fine, another flamethrower, why not? Goodbye. Wonderful. Um, this is working out for me. No, same same thing. Who? Wait, who was it? Oh, Magnezone. Is it also a steal? I think so. Flamethrower, my friend. 
Ah, oh, man, come on, my dude. Critical hit even and still has one. Oh, he has sturdy, that's why. All right, light screen. All right. Uh, let me just hit him with a size shock or something. Gotcha. This has been going pretty well. Uh, so. Oh, Tinkerton. But I, it's whatever it is. Oh no, I know what Tinkerton. That's that's a fairy steel, right? So keep the current Pokemon. And uh, I could Terrasilize. I'm not scared. My last Pokemon will turn things around. I'm worried if I Terrasilize, it'll I won't be able to Terrasilize again. Is that how this works? Or I don't want to waste a Terrasilize when I. Oh gosh, that hammer breaks the mold even. Let me use the armor cannon. It's time to get dressed up all pretty, Tinky. I don't think I need to terrorize. I hope I don't need to. All right. Yeah, terrorize steel. Ugh, super effective, but that's okay. This one move might faint it, right? Maybe this is a big move. Oh God, it's not even good enough. Oh no. Uh oh. Can I go again? <laughs> nope. Dang, I survived. Hit him again. Hit him again. Oh. Oh my gosh. Uh, let me. What? What else could that be weak to? Uh, steel is what else is weak to let me pull up my type chart steel is weak to fire fighting ground ground let me uh, bring out uh, well actually you know I just need let's just bring out a quick attack this is not very effective dang oh it's oh man dang steel is oh man okay whatever what am I doing as a steel I'm, I'm an idiot all right, that's fine. Uh, let me just hit him with a quick attack, maybe. How not effective is this? Dang, I think it's still alive. <laughs> uh, steel hard Pokemon. Oh, it's a solid victory, so I'm going to win. You might faint my Pikachu, my Raichu. Get a ton of hammers coming out. This is a bad idea. It's a bad idea, dude. Yep, my bad. All right. Whatever. Just bring out anyone, dude. Bring out H Dog. Let's do a crunch. Maybe I should terrorize. I don't know. Come on. Oh, that, that wasn't so bad. Here comes a crunch. Awesome. Oh, man. All right. Awesome, a dog leveled up. Sorry. Ugh. <laughs> it's my best uh, voice impression of her. Any claps for me? Wow, wow! I wanted to take revenge on you, Rika. Pretty sure you mean take revenge for me, Squirt. Don't think I did anything wrong by you. Hate to say it, but you lost, Poppy. Better call the next guy. Oh, that's right. I haven't had to do this in a long time. All right, who's the next guy? It's your turn, Mr. Larry. Larry? Wait, what? What? He's also the Elite Four? What? Good to see you again. Hello there, it's me, Larry. <laughs> Indeed it is. Uh, what's he doing back, though? In my bag, I need to get a revive. Use it on Raichu, and then let I'm I'm gonna keep using these super potions. Just because I have a lot of them, and uh, there we go. Use one over here on H Dog as well.
And then, how about one more? Uh, no. There you go. Okay, now, Larry... I, I mean, I don't remember what Larry was. What type was Larry? Oh, I really don't know. Um... Let's just let's just don't worry about it. Let's just go in. We'll 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 get a custom. Are you ready to face Larry of the Elite Four? This is the same guy, right? Yes. So you made it this far. I serve as a member of the Elite Four too. Yes, unfortunately for me. At my gym I use normal type Pokemon since I feel they have a lot of in common with me. But well, the boss told me to use a different type here. So if you have any complaints, please take them up with La Primera. So what type is he using? All right. Think about it. Anyway, time to get to work. Right. Let's go. It's Larry again of the Elite Four this time. Uh, Tropius. That looks like a grass type. If it's grass and it's weak to fire, is he using grass? Well, I'll be. Oh, flying type. He's, he says it right here. So flying is. Indifferent to, to fire, right? So, uh, let me look at my type chart. Flying. Well, hold on. Flying, weak to electric and ice. Uh, ice would be super weak because he's a grass. Let me, I haven't really got the chance to use B-Dog. So, let's bring out B-Dog. Swap it in. And see if we can blast him with some ice. That'll be good, right? And it, oh, and if he is flying, ice will be good against everything. So, I don't know which one's better. Let's use ice beam. Let's do it. No, no, not dragon pulse. What? All right, super effective, but whatever. Ice beam. Oh, ho, ho, that's pretty good. All right. If he keeps up, keeps up with this flying stuff, this will be really good. Uh, Staraptor. That's that's keep the current Pokemon. Let's go. We'll deal with Staraptor as he sends him out. Dang, I forgot about Intimidate. Ice beam. Let's do it. Oh man, close combat. Are you joking, kidding me, dude? I need to heal already. All right. Ice speed. All right, another one hit. I'm. An, I, I need to heal. Uh, I just keep uh, keep the current Pokemon, but we're gonna have to heal. Uh, in my bag, there is a Hyper Potion. 120. Oh, man. Hyper, that's not enough. Max Potion. I don't have very many potions. I should have really, really stocked up before coming in here, honestly. All right. Dragon, no, freaking Dragon Pulse. Gosh, it's super effective. I hate that. Uh, let's do an Ice Beam. All right, got him, good. Man, okay, so. All right, the sunlight faded, good. Keep the current Pokemon. Or a Corio. what is this? It's so small, Ice Beam, hit him. Let me go first, dang it. What's Teeter dancing to do? It's gonna make me dizzy and confused, oh no. Please tell me I can hit him though. Don't hit myself with this. I know I'm confused. I get it. I'm confused. Dang it. Hit him with the ice beam. No. Okay, I'm fine. I'm fine. Just hit him. Don't get too confused. I'm, okay, good. You snap me on my confusion. Ice beam time. I need to heal. All right. I don't know if I can terrestrialize every time. Uh, I really don't know. Uh, let's do keep the current Pokemon. You're even stronger than before. I guess I don't have to get a break today. Man, I really don't know. 
If it's flying, it's also going to be weak to electric, so that's good news. Let me do Icicle Crash. I want to see this in action, dude. At the risk of messing my suit up a bit, it's time to get some wind on our backs. I should have healed first. I'm an idiot. All right. Dang it. I'm dead. I'm dead. The thing is, is Raichu doesn't terrestrialize. I don't have any rocks, I don't think. Uh, uh, Raichu doesn't terrestrialize as electric. Terrestrializes as a flying. Which I guess wouldn't be terrible. Uh, let me just do a thunder punch, see where this lands me. Haha, <laughs> super effect. That was great, dude. Nice. All right, who's next, man? I could, I could take this. This is good stuff. I need to heal, though. All right. Uh, sorry, Larry, for beating you again. Well, that took the wind out from under our wings. Indeed it did. Indeed it did, Larry. I'm sorry. Sorry, not sorry. You're a lot stronger than I recall. No wonder La Primera likes you. Now then, I suppose the final member of the Elite Four is next. It's your turn, Hassle. Don't hassle me. That name sounds familiar. Now, where could he be? Uh, I don't think he heard you, Larry. <laughs> you just come on in, Hassle. Larry, you, you may need to speak up just a little bit more. <laughs> Hassle? Hassle, you're up next. There he is. That guy looks familiar. He's probably talked to me before. Hello there, Z-Dog. It delights me to see you here. As for you, Larry, I see you made Rika do the shouting again. Hmm? All right. Well, let me get my guys healed up if I can. In my bag, uh, there is a revive to use on B-Dog. And then also a couple super potions that we will use on B-Dog as well. There you go. Super good. Uh, what type is this guy? That's what I want to know. I'm ready to face him, yes. I was, of course, absolutely certain you would make it to me eventually. Young sprouts truly do grow with astounding speed, yes, but I never for a moment imagined we would be facing each other so soon. Now, a teacher's duty is to guide students and aid their growth, but I think I shall forget about my role as a teacher for a moment. Oh boy, and wield all my might for the sole purpose of defeating you. I am Hassel, the dragon guarding the final fortress of the elite test. So he's dragon type. Def prepare to learn firsthand how the fiery breath of ferocious battle feels. So if he's dragon type. Just pulling up my uh, chart. Ice, dragon, and fairy. Great. Ice, dragon, and fairy. Uh, I do have an ice type that will work pretty well, I think. Noivern. So that that's a dragon? It looks kind of dragony. Uh, but yeah, anyway, let me bring out my ice. Show me everything you've got. I shall face you with my full strength. All right. Uh, also fairy. Play rough will work. Also ace dogs. But I guess we'll just switch over to this. It terrestrializes as a dark, though, not an ice. Oh, it's a dragon itself. Oh, I don't like that because the dragon moves will hurt me even more. Dang. Uh, shoot. I don't know, man. How does how does steel fare against dragons? Uh, you would think that steel would slay a dragon, right? But it's not. It's indifferent. Let's just bring out T Dog. I use play rough a few times, I guess. Honestly, terrestrializing as a dark type would be great. Or whatever the type was. God. What was the type? Hyper Voice. Okay, that was nothing. So, let me hit you with this play rough. All right, super effective. Uh, can I do it one more time, please? Nope, super fang. 
dang, I need to heal already. All right. Well, okay. Uh, sure, just uh, keep the current Pokemon, but we'll try to heal them. Wow, that's a cool looking Pokemon, dude. Uh, let me go ahead and do a, a max potion on me. I hope that it's good enough. I don't know. I'm feeling a little weak with this T Dog here, but at least I'm not doing nothing. Hydro Pump. That wasn't so bad. Play rough. I'm gonna have to do that two more times. This play rough is not that great. But neither is Hydro Pump, so I should I avoided that one somehow. So let's just end with the play rough. Alright. Um Ice and Dragon, man, Ice and Dragon. Haxorus. I just, I'll just keep the current Pokemon for the moment. Mold Breaker. It broke the mold! I don't know what that means. Play rough. Oh, that was really good. Iron Head. I don't know. Okay, that wasn't so bad either. Play rough. Let's go. Alright. Great. There's one more after this. And then, and then another one. <laughs> so two more after this. Flapple. So cute. I'm gonna have to heal, I think. Max potion me. Here we go. Seed bomb. Not effective at all, dude. What were you thinking? I only have three more play roughs, so... Okay, cool. Super effective, great. It's attack fell. Sorry, Flapple. Another seed bomb. I'm, it's interesting that, like, th these Elite Four seem a lot easier than the Gym Leaders. The Gym Leaders seem like their types varied up a little bit. Maybe I'm wrong. Alright, so one more. I think... Uh, hold on, what? All right. If so my plan is to switch to B-Dog. Then Terrasalize. And then... Uh, assuming this is the last one he sends out, right? Go B-Dog. And then I'll be a, a Dark type or whatever. Which... Uh, oh, shoot. Is also weak to Dragon. Son of a gun. Oh wait, I'm wrong. Dragon against dragon? Oh no, I misread it. No, it's fine. No, dark is fine. Never mind. So I was looking, I was looking one over. Dark is weak against. Okay, anyway, it's fine against dragon. So battle. Terrestrialize, which is gonna be dark. But I'm gonna do a dragon claw. Come, oh great dragon, and take a Terra Jewel as your crown. All right. Oh what? Wait, it's the same as me. Wait, what? I just, I don't know how I just realized that we're looking. So he terrestrializes into a dragon type, whereas I terrestrialize into a dark type. So my dragon attacks will be super effective against him, but his dragon attacks won't be super effective against me. That's smart, Zach. Awesome. Love it. You love it. I love it. We all love it. Awesome. No point in letting this drag on. Behold the power to overwhelm everything. All right, I'm not so sure I like this. Oh, that was painful. Oh, but Dragon Claws a one hit against you. Your Baxcalibur fainted. I forgot my guy was named Baxcalibur because I just renamed mine to B-Dog, so. Well, there you go. We got two level ups. There we go. M Dog wants to learn the move Leaf Storm. Sure, let's see what Leaf Storm can do. Uh, one thirty ninety. Uh, 
I don't know. Nah. Nah. <laughs> I don't know. I'm okay. The, the always crit, I think it's a good. Gotcha, hassle. The mighty dragon has been felled. Indeed it has. Well, that worked out pretty well for me. Rika's clapping again. You really did it. Oh, wow. Huh. What wonderful. <laughs> what? I, I'm just so proud of you. <laughs> Don't cry, Grandpa Hassel there. There, want a hug? Yeah, embarrassing that he's crying. Sorry about all this, Z Dog. The old man can get like that sometimes. So what I do? I just, I just be so overwhelmed. <laughs> Guess I gotta do the talking. Anyway, your result for the elite test of the champion assessment is, yeah, no, a pass, no doubt about it. Yeah, you're tougher than steel and dragon. Yep. You did so beautifully. Congratulations. I'd say you're good to go, but there's actually just a wee bit more to the champion assessment. This will be your final trial. So see the door back there? Yes, our fearless commander, the final opponent you'll face for your test is waiting beyond it. Her skills are so amazing. She was able to strong arm all of us into joining the Elite Four. You won't find a mightier champion, though. I think you'll do fine, kiddo. You beat me after all. I'll patch up your team on the house, so don't lose, you hear? I hope that means my terrestrializing crystal or whatever is replenished. I really love your Pokemon, mister. So I'll cheer you on as hard as I can. Well, uh, good luck. Even a baby dragon can breathe fire. Whoa, guess you got over your sobs, huh? You can do this. We all know you can. Now go, young Z-Dog. Your hands may be small, but let them seize a great victory. Awesome. Well, so I've been healed. Is it is, is it Nimona I face off against next, or or what? I don't know. Let's just go. Everything's been healed on the house. Let's just go behind the door. The final test of the champ champion assessment. Yes, I don't think I have a choice but to move forward. So let's do it. I'm ready if you're ready. Wow, what a beauty. What a beauty place. Beautiful place. All right. Welcome, Z Dog. It's Gita. It gives me great joy that you've managed to make it all the way to the pinnacle of the Pokemon League. The final test is a battle against me, the top champion. To pass, all you need to do is win. But before we get started, I should apologize for one thing. You see, I have a trait that some might say is inappropriate for a League chairwoman. I am utterly incapable of holding back when it comes to Pokemon battles. Maybe that's why nobody's passed this test recently. It's a bit of a problem, to be honest. But you, you might manage something wonderful like Champion Nimona did. So, are you ready for the final test? I want to see the true measure of your talent. I am ready. I'm worried that this will be hard. <laughs> All right. Top champion, Gita. Coming out. What's she sending out? Uh, Espartra. What, what is Espartra? Hold on. Hold on. I'm Googling it. I do hope you can defeat me and become a champion. Espartra. Thra. S. 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 Pathra. S. S. Pathra. There we go. That's that's it. It's a psychic. Okay, that's easy. Look at my type chart. Psychic is weak to bug, ghost, and dark. So I can switch to a, a dark move. Night slash is super effective. Let's do that really quick. Uh, and you know, psychic's no not strong against grass at all. So swap an M dog. Made my starter. We'll do some uh, good old dark attacks. All right. Now it doesn't affect me, whatever you did. I didn't even look. I'm looking at a type chart. Oh, ho, ho, super effective. Yes, that was the correct decision in this situation. Please continue. Yeah, okay. Dazzling gleam. Oof, that was, ugh, that was harsh. What's the matter? You're not one to let something so in insignificant fluster you. 
Let me just do this really quick. Let me get another one off, please. Thank you. Good lord. Um, what's coming out next? Go goat. Is that a? What do you think that is? A grass or something? Goats eat grass. Go goat is. Oh yeah, a grass type. So fire. Hey dog, come on out. Swap in, please. I'm gonna get you with fire. Hey dog, welcome. What level are we? 64 and 60. I'm I out level. That's great. Flamethrower coming at you real quick. Hopefully it's a one hit. No, oh, it's not. Dang, dude. All right, bulk up. What does bulk up do? Oh, it's attack rose. Well, that's okay. I'll get to I'll get to hit again, right? Hit him again. Hit him again. I get to go first. Great. Go goat is gone. Awesome. Uh, Avalok. That's an ice. Avalok's an ice, right? I hope I'm not wrong. Yeah, ice. I knew it. I feel like I knew that from uh, one of the recent from uh, Pokemon Legends Arceus or something. Oh, that's a one hit, dude. That's awesome. All right. Uh, King Gambit. What the heck is that? I don't know what that is. King Gambit. One word. What the heck? It's a dark steel. That means fire should just do work just fine. If I had fighting, it'd be extra good. Let me just keep the keep the current Pokemon, and we'll do some more fire then. I don't think I've seen this. Oh, wow. Gain strength from the Fallen. What does that mean? Here's a flamethrower for you, by the way. Okay. Stone Edge. Ooh, super effective. I hate it. One more. I get to go first, though, right? Good. Oof. I'm going to need to heal next time. All right, excellent Veluza. What the heck is that? <laughs> I do not know what these things are. Okay, because I've never encountered them before, I guess is why. Veluza is a water psychic. Let me look at that chart table. Weak against grass and electric. Perfect. Let me switch in. Uh, oh, let me switch in Raichu, I guess. What the heck? All right, Veluz is here. Mold Breaker. Thunder Punch, my friend. Oh yeah, another one. This is going so well. <laughs> Knock on wood. So, what's gonna happen here? Glamora, oh, I guess it doesn't matter what Glamora is. Actually it does, because their attacks will be Something I want to watch out for. Rock and poison. I don't know what it's going to terrorize to. If it's a rock and poison, I'm going to want to be like a uh, fighting ground. Yeah, I want, I want to be ground. Do I have a ground type? Oh, yeah. H Dog. It could terrorize into ground. So that way I could defend myself against a lot of its moves. Whatever this ends up. I don't know what it's going to tear slides into, though. So that's a little worrisome. I don't know what it's going to tear slides into. You don't think you've won just yet? Oh, man. I really don't know what it's going to do. I'm going to... You know what? I get to dig. I get to buy some time. I get to dig under... I only outrank this by one level. Be the life of guys. All trainers, Glamora. All right. Well, her hair is going crazy. What is that? What is that? Are those rocks? Oh, no. Earth. Oh, okay. That's fine. I think that's a rock type. And if it is a rock type, then I think I might have chosen it correctly. Let me see. Is rock type... 
Now that's how you're supposed to. That's this is how you're supposed to unleash a move. Okay, Terra Blast. Guess what? I'm not here. So prepare to get grounded. Super effective. I love that. Uh, what is that? Toxic debris. Yeah, ground is good against rock. Great. This is actually perfect, dude. Here, I, I can terrestrialize because I'm a ground type and dig. This is awesome. This is wonderful. I might actually win this without having any of my guys faint. All right. Let's do it. Let's do it. Terra, I, 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 are you going to miss? No, it's going to hit me. No, 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 no. Dang, but not very effective. Let me get out of here. Let me get out of your hair, out of your way. This is actually going to work, dude. This is going to be amazing. I avoided whatever that was. Boom. Wow. I can't believe I did it. I had such a great team for this. And Toxic Debris is still here, but Glamora, you're dead. You fainted. All right. Top champion, Gita. Got him. Clap, clap, clap. You go beyond my imagination so easily. Indeed, I do. Very awesome. All right. Uh, such overwhelming power, such amazing skill. It seems Paldia has gained another wonderful trainer to be proud of. Congratulations, it's my honor to call you Champion Z-Dog. Congratulations is right, now I can really say you're good to go. Defeated the Elite Four, defeated the Champion. You did it, mister. Congratulations. Just amazing, I can't, I can't hold it anymore. Oof, crying again. Her hair is so wild. Your Poke you Pokemon trainers are the treasure of Paldea, and amid that treasure, champions are the jewels that shine brightest. Champion Z-Dog, it is now your duty to set an example for all of the trainers of Paldea. Now, allow me to walk you back to the entrance. I'm certain you'll find a familiar face awaiting you. Is it Nimona? Because I need, I mean, that's the whole point I'm here, is to see Nimona. Does she want to fight me again? There's been a lot of fighting today. Can't read that. <laughs> Z-Dog, Z-Dog. Oh man, I can just tell by looking at you, you did it right. You became a champion. Yes. Ha <laughs> ha I knew all along. I got word from La Primera that when you cleared the elite test. Oh man, Z-Dog, I'm a champion and now you're a champion. We should get married. Oh, okay, she didn't say, I said that. Which means we're true equals, you and me, both champion ranked trainers. This is amazing. Now that you made it here, I've got one thing to say. Let's you and me be the best rivals for life. I do. Yes, Tamaya. All right, you know what rivals do? They get married. They battle their absolute hearts out. I'm gonna hit you with everything this time. You ready? Do wait a moment, Champion Nimona. Huh, what's the matter, Primera? The champion assessment has only just ended. I believe a rest is in order for Champion Z-Dog, Amarog, and the others. Champions must be understanding towards their opponents. Ugh, right. There I go, getting overexcited again. Sorry, Z-Dog. I must ask, is this roadside really the setting you two want for your first battle as true equals? As rival and rivals? Hmm, now that you mention it, that's a good point. In that case, we can use one of the Pokemon League Battle Courts? Surely there's somewhere more fitting a place with special meaning for the two of you, perhaps. Special meaning, hmm, let me see. Anywhere leap to mind, Z-Dog? Out behind your house. Probably. Haha, <laughs> <laughs> our beach out back, huh? Yeah, that place where we first had our first battle might work. But on the other hand, to me, it's just kind of my backyard, you know, a little ordinary. Any place else come to mind? <laughs> the treasure eatery. The treasure eatery, is it significant to the two of you somehow? Ah, uh, you're thinking of it because it's got the medallion. I don't know, I guess it does bring back memories of Larry. What the heck, I don't know. Larry may not appreciate the surprise visit. Okay, yeah, I have one more suitable place, Mesagosa. <laughs> Mesagosa, oh, good call, the place where we set out on our journey. That reminds me, Z-Dog. Remember back when D Director Clavel explained the treasure hunt? You know how he told us to go in search of our own treasure? Well, I know what treasure I got out of all this. I found a true rival, someone who can stand up to me at my full capabilities. That's right, I mean you. I'm so glad I got to meet you, Z-Dog. Anyway, that being said, 
I'll be waiting for you at the battle court in Mesa Goza Central Plaza. See you there. All right. The respect you two share is palpable, even a bit enviable, to be honest. I am known as La Primera, but even when facing me in the final test of her champion assessment, champion Nimona didn't reveal her full might. And you, I suspect she has found someone she can battle without holding anything back. Well, I suppose I better do it then. I guess. <laughs> battle Nimona. So that will be what I do. And uh, let me first, I guess, rest. I mean, I, I don't know if my guys are rested. I could use a rest. I could also buy some more things. That would be super important in case I needed to just outlast. I'm not sure what she's going to have for me uh, to go up against. But Armor Rogue and the rest of your team should be all better now. Oh, and I went ahead and charged up your Terra Orb too. Come back and see us again whenever you need. Great. And then uh, let me buy uh, Max Potions. Let me just uh, get like... 20 of those with cash and then where are the revives all right let me just get 12 revives all right so I think the question is like do I do I go uh, and face off against her now or do I wait till next episode I'm not really sure like I don't know how long her fight will take uh, maybe it won't take that long. Maybe it'll be really quick and then over with and then uh, Let's just go do it. How about that? How about that? Let's squeeze it in here I know it's gonna be over an hour for the episode, but let's just do it. Where is she located? Let me pull up the map And she be where right over here So fly there at the Mesa Goza Let's fight against Nimona my best friend my rival my future wife uh, Unless someone else wants to marry me <laughs> Uh, but let's see um, how, I, I think I'm gonna win obviously I mean I, I better win because I mean I just want all the other stuff so we shall see what's gonna happen I, I don't know she has the starter that's like the weakest to me so let's go let's do it here we go there she's waiting for me I do all right any second now there she is there you are Z dog Great, I'm glad to see you. You ready for a battle between the champions? Because all these folks seem to be ready to watch. Word got around, I guess. All right, let's do it. Even the Elite Four are here. All right, and out of every single person gathered here, I'm the most excited by the mile, by a mile. No, I am. It's me. Everyone's here to watch, even Larry. The stage is set. It's my all out power. Versus your strength in full fruition. Let's see who comes out on top. It's going to be me, right? Please tell me it's going to be me. Uh, let's see. All right. I don't know who... I, I, I got a dog still in my in, in my uh, lead. Lycan Rock. What's, what's Lycan Rock? Is it just a rock? Is it just a rock? Have I not learned this one yet? Finally, the thing I've waited all this time for. Time to begin our greatest battle of all. It is just a rock. Okay, great. That means it's going to be weak to grass. So I can switch out my Pokemon and bring out my starter. That'll be a good hit. All right. Let's do it, dudes. All right, that doesn't, that doesn't bother me. Just a little, couple of rocks. I'm not wearing shoes, but whatever. Oh, she outlevels me. That's scary. Stone Edge. God, why is it so painful? There you go. Super effective. My goodness. A critical hit, believe it or not. To think I helped teach you type matchups, and now you're using him to put the hurt on me. All right, a critical hit at a critical moment. That goes beyond luck. You've got some kind of gift. All right, like your rock's gone. Who's coming out now? Palmont. All right, hold on. <laughs> I want to be ready for this. Palmont is cute. Oh, electric fighting. Okay, I've seen the Palmont before. That means, according to the type chart, it's going to be weak to ground. 
uh, Flying Psychic. So let me just switch out Ground Flying Psychic. Let's do... Well, I do have the ground move. I also have a couple... Uh, wait, Amirage has a Psychic move. Psy Shock, right? Let's bring in A-Dog really quick. See if I can get something done here. Come on, a dog. What level are you? Uh, all right, side shock is super effective. Let's go. Double shock. Oh no! Don't do two of. Oh my gosh, these are painful hits. But you use up all the electricity. Here comes the side shock. Oh, that was a one hit. That's awesome. All right. Awesome. All right, uh, Worthworm. That is... Uh, okay, that's a steel. Okay, yeah, sure, great. We'll keep with fire then. And I'm gonna need to heal though, so let me pull up something from my bag. We use a max potion. And then I'll use a fire move against you. If you let me, if you're nice about it. Dang, dude. How do you like my real hard hits? Man, it feels good to finally let loose. I wasn't anticipating that. But uh, let's do a armor cannon, maybe? Please tell me this will work and just do be a one hit. Nice. Awesome. All right, I can switch out of uh, my special defense spell, so let me switch out. <laughs> uh, Gudra, what is Gudra? It's a Gudra. Gudra is either a dragon or a steel dragon. I think it's just a dragon. All right, so dragons are weak to ice. Dragon and Fairy. Man, I do have Ice and Dragon on demand here, but if it does a Dragon attack, it's gonna be str I don't like this Dragon on Dragon violence. Uh, let me see. I'm also a Dragon, so it's just so weird. I have a Play Rough here. I also have a Fairy here that I could use. Let's just, let's just do the Play Rough. Maybe that'll be good. I don't know. What do you think? All right, Stone's dug in a T-Dog. Let's play rough, we're equal level. Oh, that was a good hit. One more hit like that and we should be good. Muddy water. Okay, that was nothing really. My accuracy fell, that's okay. Let me just hit him one more time with play rough. Unless it fails. Dang it, dude. Are you joking? Kidding me? Another muddy water. All right. One more play rough then, right? It hits. Good. Bruh. <laughs> All right. <laughs> dun, dun, the dun sparse. What is that? The dun sparse is... Oh, a normal. Oh, so it's only gonna be weak to fighting. Uh, I'm just gonna keep the current Pokemon and see what I can do. I don't think I have fighting on me at all. But, you know, a steel, I mean, I have a really strong Gigaton hammer, so let me just use it. Let's, let's, let's use it, see if I can just finish him off. Oh, uh, what? How'd you avoid that? Oh, because it, it's not 100%, is it? Dang. Hold on, let me look at it. Is it, is it? Hold on, move info. No, it's 100%. What? How did it fail? Oh, because my accuracy's down. Oh, I can't use it twice in a row. Dang it, dude. Oh, uh, you're killing me. Um, let me just pull it up in my bag really quick then and just do a max heal. I don't want anyone to die, necessarily. All right. Drill run. That, that hurt last time. I avoided it this time, though. 
Uh, Gigaton Hammer. Let's hit him. I, come on, I didn't use it twice in a row. It was a different move. All right, let's do a Flash Cannon. I don't know. Gosh, it's so weak. Drill Run. All right, super effective against me. I hate it. Let's do a Gigaton Hammer this time. Please hit. Excellent. Okay, that's not really that much better. Another Drill Run coming at me, and I am fainted. Okay. Sorry, T Dog, but that's just how it has to be. See that crit? I clinched through that sheer with uh, I clinched that through sheer determination and will. Good for you. I'm I'm proud of you. Uh, how many more does she have? I'll swap it. I'll just do right you. I'll do like a fly and get out of here or something. I need to heal. They're just all effective. Let's do a thunder punch. Oh, got him. Good. Okay, great. Awesome. Uh, who's next? Is this their last one coming up? Uh, Qua Quaval. Uh, oh yeah, this is the, this is the, uh, it's like a, it's, it's the water, right? So the grass is gonna be perfect. Oh man, why is it so weak? Okay, whatever. Quaquaval does not scare me, but I'm a little scared. I'm, I'm afraid they'll get the first move and then just bait me. It's all down to this, my last Pokemon. We're gonna fight with everything we've got. All right. I I should heal, I think. I don't know, should I heal? I think I should heal. Maybe I can get... Let me just heal with the max potion. I, don't, I just don't wanna, you know, get one hit. Like this thing goes first or something, because I have a great move. I'm gonna terrestrialize myself. Shine blazingly bright, my greatest treasure. What does it terrestrialize into though? I totally forget. Because mine does mine's terrestrializes into something different. Uh oh good, it's water. Okay, perfect. Perfect. You're going down. Brick break. Oh no. Dang, dude, are you joking? Kidding me? All right. Uh, heal again. Max potion. One more time. Gosh. If they just do brick break again, I'm just like done. Get ready to see how strong Quaquaval has grown since the day we all met. Aqua step. Now that's not gonna bother me too much, is it? Not very effective. Okay, so speed rose, which I hate. Uh, battle flower trick, terrorized flower trick. I hope I get to go first. <laughs> I may not, with the speed going up on the other one. All right, tell me I got this. I've terrestrialized, I got Brick Break. I'm still alive! Flower Trick, could one hit, if I'm lucky. Oh, super effective, critical hit. Wow. Well, today's episode has went very well, by the way. I got you. All right, so what say you? Whoa, what's she doing? She's covering her eyes. Is she crying? They all look concerned for her. You. You did it! <laughs> this is legit incredible. You're the strongest out there, Z-Dog. I can't believe she's happy for me. I mean, you knocked me flat, and I was giving you absolutely everything I had. Everything I... I... <laughs> Oh man, Pokemon battling, am I right? It's so much better, so much more fun than I ever even knew. Thanks for the incredible match. You beat me for real this time. Now we have to get married. Winner's choice, right? 
All right, now let's give ourselves a minute and have a quick break, Z Dog. Before round two. <laughs> I'm gonna have to battle her for the rest of my life. Which Pokemon should I bring out this time? Decisions, decisions. Well, now that you know what I have, I mean, you could probably match against it pretty well, honestly. Uh, but yeah, decisions, decisions. Decisions. I'm in my room. Victory Road has been completed. That's amazing. So now, you know, I'm getting a call. Yo, Arvin here. Bow wow. Whoa, down boy, don't jump up like that. Seems like hearing your voice has old Mabasif here all worked up, Z-Dog. Oh, but that's not why I called. Nearly forgot. You remember what we talked about before? About going to Area Zero? Yes. Of course you do, you little know-it-all. Got a mind like a steel trap, huh? Well, all the effort you've been putting in around Paldea has really helped make a name for yourself. Built up some goodwill, that's for sure. So I've been able to secure two allies who want to go to Area Zero with us. That should have us ready to tackle anything. So now, we've all just got to go, go get there. First step, will be gathering at Area Zero. I'll be ready and waiting at Zero Gate. I'll send you the location on your phone, too. Don't leave me hanging forever. All right, great. So that's where we're going next episode, which is probably the finale. I don't know if there's any post-game content, but that's what we're going to be tackling next episode. So I do appreciate you all. Thanks for watching. We're going to head to the Zero Gate next episode. Goodbye. I'm Zach Scott. Subscribe if you have not. If you like this video and want to help the channel grow, all you got to do is click the like button below. Thank you so much for watching. You can now join on YouTube and become an official member of Zach Scott Games. And if you want cool shirts like this, visit ZachScott.shop. Come back next time for more.